Hey guys, welcome to Freedom in a Budget. I am Kelly. If you are new here, welcome. I hope that you scroll down and hit that subscribe button and stick around, watch some videos, like this video. I have so much different content on this channel from weight loss videos to meal prep to grocery hauls to budget videos, so much. So I'm sure you will find it something that you like. So I hope that you stick around. And if you are already a subscriber, thank you so much for coming back and let's get into it. So it is way in Wednesday time and I'm happy to say I lost 0.9 pounds. So almost a whole pound this week on Weight Watchers and intuitive eating. As you guys know, I'm combining the two with the Weight Watchers freestyle program with smart points and intuitive eating, which has been really good of just listening to my body, staying in tune, and just following the smart points, it's been great. I have had a little trouble with working out, so I don't know what my problem is. I've had really low energy when I get out of work. I'm not motivated in the mornings. I did go to the gym and did the Couch to 5K one day on Monday last week, and I was so excited about it. I drank tons of water throughout the day. I made sure that I ate healthy, and I was like, all right, let's do this. And I was going, going, it was good. And then halfway through 15 minutes in, I just, all energy like was gone. I usually get crimps on my left side, right by my ribs. I had crimps on both the right and left side. And then I started feeling dizzy and just lightheaded. And so I was like, all right, we obviously need to stop this. So I stopped halfway through, um, which I was really disappointed because I wanted to do the full 30 minutes. But yeah, that didn't happen. So I didn't do it again last week just because every time I left work I was exhausted and so I've really been struggling of how to get my workouts in you know I'm still struggling with this virus um, if you guys saw a couple weeks ago I have so I got it when like the same time that Jamie had the flu and I forget the full name but it's something rose rosia or something and I had I started seeing spots all over my stomach and that almost looked like hives or different or I don't know it wasn't like chicken pox looking it was just more like hives looking and they were just everywhere all over my stomach and my back and then i went to nurse practitioner at work and she said oh you have blah 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 blah. i was like okay what's that so we looked it up and she explained it to me and she said it's nothing to be concerned about it's not really contagious um but it does have flu light symptoms so you are going to be feeling run down and everything and it takes like six to eight weeks to clear up great so yeah i'm still struggling with that um, which just means I'm very worn out. Even today, I'm very worn out, very tired, um, just doing stuff around the house, and I did some deep cleaning, and I'm exhausted from it. So I'm struggling with my workouts. And I was talking to one of my coworkers about this, who is like, well, she was actually asking me to work out this coming Monday because it's President's Day, which you guys are watching this later. So Monday's President's Day, so she wants me to work out in the morning. And I'm like... I just don't have the energy in the morning. Like even if I have coffee first thing, I just don't have energy. So, um, you know, I usually work through my lunch. I do have a work a gym at work with showers and everything, so I can work on my lunch break. But I work through lunch every um, every day, and so just to get the overtime. And you know, she's like, "Well, why don't you do it at lunch?" And I said, "The overtime of lunch." She's like, "Kelly, like, money's not everything. You know, your health is important too." And I was like, "You know what? You're right." So, I don't know, I'm gonna talk to my boss, see if we can try to mix up my schedule a little bit, maybe coming, um, I usually work 7.30 to five now. Um, so was that nine and a half hour days? So maybe coming in at seven, maybe only taking, working like nine hour days and taking an hour lunch at like 11. Cause during the day I do have energy, like, you know, 11, 12, one o'clock, I have lots of energy. So maybe that's the story. But by the time that five o'clock rolls, rolls around, like I'm exhausted. Even cooking dinner is, is tough for me. So I'm gonna try that. I'm gonna talk to my boss this week and see if that makes a difference. But I really need to get these workouts going. I know that, um, you know, the eating out, though eating healthy is, is helping. I'm losing, you know, almost a pound a week. But I feel like if I start working out, I'm gonna see faster results. So that's really important to me. I don't know. So guys, what do you do? Do you struggle with this? Is this something that just I'm struggling with? What are your energy levels like throughout the day? What have you found to help, um, you know, combat that? And what's what? give me some tips. I need some tips from you guys. All right, guys, so let me know. Let me know how your weigh-in went. Did you lose? Did you gain? Did you maintain? What's going on with you? Let me know. All right, guys, I will talk to you later. Bye.